What's going on guys, this is Burrs. I want to talk to you today about the 762 Tactical Plain Jane Chess Rig. This is a preview video just to kind of go over what I have here and what I'm looking to do with it. Kind of show you how I have it set up and uh, give you an idea what I'm looking to do with it as far as courses and stuff go in the future. Kind of testing it out. This is kind of something different. I don't usually do preview videos, but uh, I thought I'd kind of do one and uh, see how you guys like it. As far as the plain Jane chess rig, what is it? So it basically doesn't look like this. It's basically nothing. It's a um, you know a sheet of uh, you know pals webbing, and you have some uh, shoulder straps attached. I opted for the uh, padded shoulder straps, and you basically set up how you want. So all the pouches and everything on here are um, not. Uh, they don't come with the plain Jane uh, chest rig, so it's basically my setup or your setup, whoever you know is the purchase. It's their setup, and um, that's how um, the plain Jane chest rig works. So how do I have this uh, set up? You know, from uh, we'll go from you know this side to uh, to that side. So over here, I got a single mag pouch, and then on the front, I got a flashlight. This is a flashlight. I'm also reviewing. This is a four sevens. So I have that on this side. Next to it, I got a double mag pouch. I guess we'll talk about the specifics here. So this is an Ares Armor uh, bungee pouch. This is a Fire Force mag pouch, which I've reviewed in the past. Uh, this is a double pouch. I have a GPS pouch right here. And on the middle here, I have a Tier Tactical medic pouch. And I kind of took a magic marker and put a medical uh, sign on the top here. Note to Tier Tactical. That'd be really cool if you could uh, get that in there. <laughs> uh, on this side, I got a radio pouch, which I have a, um, a tourniquet in the moment. Smoke pouch right here. Uh, we just uh, did a video on this. This is the uh, Enola Gay EG18 uh, smokes. They work really well. Pretty cold to the touch, and uh, they work uh, exceptionally well for the price and for the fact that they're you know, readily available at pretty much any paintball store. Uh, over here I got a single mag pouch. Uh, I could expand this to a double if I wanted to, but I have one in there for now. Um, right here we got a multi-tool. Testing this one out right now. This is a Swiss tool. Behind here I got the uh, Applegate Fairbairn um, you know, uh, folder. This is the uh, Gerber Applegate folder. And then on the back here, you can see I got some uh, chem lights kind of strewn across here. And the other cool thing about this is it has a pouch where you can kind of open up the middle. Uh, so I got some papers in here that are specific to me. And um, so you can, you know, put some stuff in there if you want. Um, on the back here, you can see here's a 762 tactical patch. And then I opted for the, uh, the padded um, you know, uh, shoulder uh, straps. And these really make the difference in my opinion. And the way I use this is I use a chest rig, I mean not chest rig, I use a plate carrier and then the plate carrier can hold some items um, nice and minimalist uh, style. Uh, and if need be, you know, I take this and uh, we'll apply this to the plate carrier. Um, so I'll go ahead and turn this around, show you what the back looks like. Super simple, you know, Throw this on, clip it tight, you're good to go. Um, I put some, uh, what the hell is this called? Camo form. <laughs> put some camo form on different areas just to keep you know, the strap management in place. Uh, it's the one thing I'd actually like to see done here is towards the ends, just have these uh, sewn shut so that you can uh, you know, prevent um, the you know, ends of the webbing from coming out the straps um, and on the front here you know I had this set up how I went I don't need it to move or anything like that so I went ahead and camo formed um, the uh, adjustment points because I have it exactly where I want it um, so as you can see you know it's it's made very well and uh, we'll see what we get out of it got some classes uh, coming up um, I have a class in August with Rockwell Tactical I'm going to be taking and uh, reviewing the class and kind of talking with Jared and uh, I'm going to be using this chess rig in that class. So per pretty much probably around the September time area is when I'm going to actually fully review this chess rig. And um, by that time, you know, I'll be able to hit the range a few times, take a class or two with it, and really have a, um, a good foundation to uh, speak about it. So if you guys have any questions or anything, go ahead and let me know. If you guys have some 762 tactical stuff, go ahead and put it in the comments down below. Or better yet, make a video about it. And until next time. So as far as the plain chain, 
the plain chain what am i i don't amish country i guess hey the plain chain pennsylvania dutch